The Large Hadron Collider, LHC, is a marvel of human ingenuity and a potential harbinger of destruction hidden beneath the Earth's surface in the shadow of Geneva. Scientists can now study subatomic particles and discover the enigmatic god particle, the Higgs boson, thanks to this remarkable apparatus. Brian Cox, a well-known physicist, has made a startling statement that has left the theological community in awe, implying that something profound has been discovered at CERN with implications that go beyond our current comprehension. Understanding the Large Hadron Collider is essential before delving into the implications of Cox's statement. The LHC, which is run by CERN and is the most powerful particle accelerator in the world, is a 17-mile ring of superconducting magnets. It is the pinnacle of human achievement because it can recreate the conditions under which the universe was created. We are able to decipher the mysteries of the universe thanks to this enormous structure, which reveals something significant and potentially troubling. One of the most renowned research organizations in the world, CERN has 23 member states and a wide range of experts. It was founded in 1954. Although the LHC is CERN's main project, it is just one component of a vast network of accelerators and detectors that investigate the world of subatomic particles. Simulating the energy of the universe at the time of the Big Bang, the LHC accelerates protons to nearly light speed. The collisions that occur as a result produce temperatures that are millions of times hotter than the core of the sun. Protons are guided on their journey by a complex system of magnets, and sophisticated cooling systems keep the magnets at temperatures that are colder than those in space. The LHC's underground operation, shielded from cosmic radiation, is an engineering marvel. It is essential for the superconducting magnets to function that the entire ring is cooled to a temperature lower than the vacuum of space. Each of the four main particle detectors, ATLAS, CMS, ALIS, and LHCB, is corresponding to one of the four points along the accelerator ring where collisions occur. Scientists can now sift through the debris in search of the elusive Higgs boson, a particle essential to our comprehension of the fabric of the universe, thanks to these detectors, which capture the aftermath of collisions. The Large Hadron Collider, LHC, is more than just a scientific tool. It is also a symbol of human ambition and creativity. It stands for our thirst for knowledge and desire to comprehend our universe's fundamental forces. However, we must also take into account the moral and existential concerns that arise as we push the boundaries of our understanding. What are the dangers of venturing into the unknown? Could we accidentally unleash forces beyond our control as we strive for mastery? A revelation that has shaken even the most seasoned scientists has surfaced within the sanctified CERN halls where human understanding's frontiers are constantly expanded. A recent statement that has both captivated and alarmed the scientific community was made by Brian Cox, a respected particle physics voice and former scientist at CERN. The Large Hadron Collider at CERN aims to recreate a miniature version of the Big Bang, the event that started the universe we live in. The LHC's extraordinary capacity to create new phenomena, such as its capacity to unravel the mysteries of the Higgs boson and investigate dark matter, a substance that makes up a significant portion of the universe, was also mentioned by Cox as one of the potential outcomes of this goal. Within the LHC, the possibility of replicating a miniature Big Bang is more than just a theoretical one. Scientists are able to observe the birth of existence itself thanks to the collider's resemblance to the initial conditions of the universe. However, with such authority comes a great deal of responsibility and risk take into consideration a scenario in which something goes horribly wrong. Anatoly Bigorsky, a Russian physicist, was seriously injured in 1978 when a malfunction caused his head to collide with a proton beam at the Institute for High Energy Physics in Russia. Despite this, Bigorsky was able to survive and carry on with his research, bringing to light the enormous power and potential dangers of particle accelerators. It is not wise to take lightly the dangers that come with using a particle accelerator like the LHC. Some members of the scientific community have expressed real concerns about the potential for unanticipated reactions and the manipulation of reality's very fabric. The possibility of creating miniature black holes, regions of space-time with such a strong gravitational pull that nothing but light can escape, is one of the most significant concerns surrounding the LHC experiments. Even if the LHC created such a thing on a small scale, it could grow and eventually consume Earth from within. 
However, researchers at CERN have promised the general public that any new black holes would be ephemeral and vanish almost immediately. The fundamental workings of particle accelerators are necessary for comprehending how the LHC might produce a black hole. The energy produced by smashing protons together at speeds close to light speed has the potential to warp the very fabric of spacetime. Imagine dropping a significant amount of weight onto a tightly strecked trampoline. The surface would sag, and if the weight was heavy enough, it could poke a hole in the surface. The likelihood that the LHC will result in a gravitational anomaly is better exemplified by this analogy. Famous physicists like the late Stephen Hawking have even been intrigued by this intriguing but terrifying possibility. Hawking warned in his writings that the Higgs boson might become unstable at very high energy levels, which could lead to a catastrophic vacuum decay, which would wipe out the universe. Regarded cosmologist Sir Martin Rees has likewise voiced worries about atom smasher tests, including those at CERN. Rees examined the potential dangers of atom smasher experiments, including the production of vacuum instability, in his book on future threats to humanity. Theoretically, this instability could set off a phase transition that would spread throughout spacetime and bring about an unimaginable catastrophe. Even the tiniest possibility should give us pause, even though these scenarios remain highly speculative. The stakes are extremely high, and there is very little room for error. The specialists at CERN have carefully evaluated the potential dangers of their experiments. To reduce any potential risks, they have implemented numerous safety measures and protocols. However, scientific exploration always comes with a certain amount of uncertainty, particularly when venturing into uncharted territory. The quest for information has forever been joined by chances. However, definitively this eagerness to push limits has driven human advancement. The Large Hadron Collider, LHC, is the result of decades of research and international collaboration, but beneath its impressive exterior is a vast field of deep scientific inquiry rife with potential dangers and ethical considerations. The Collider's primary objective, which was to decipher the mysteries of particle physics, has resulted in revolutionary discoveries, such as the elusive Higgs boson. However, concerns about the potentially disastrous outcomes of such an endeavor are also raised by the enormous energies generated within its confines. Even though numerous safety precautions have been taken to reduce risks, catastrophic events like the formation of microscopic black holes or other unforeseen anomalies cannot be completely discounted. It is essential for scientists to push the boundaries of our understanding with a keen awareness of the potential consequences and a commitment to public dialogue and transparency. The LHC is a testament to human ingenuity and the unrelenting pursuit of comprehending the fundamental laws of the universe, with its unparalleled capabilities and potential for groundbreaking discoveries. However, underneath its sparkling exterior is a field of significant scientific inquiry with a number of potential risks and ethical considerations. The vast infrastructure of the collider is used for experiments that make use of energies and forces that the majority of laypeople are unable to comprehend. Scientists are able to investigate the fundamental building blocks of matter and the very fabric of spacetime because the collision of subatomic particles at nearly light speed produces conditions analogous to those that existed in the very beginning of the universe. However, these collisions' immense energies also pose significant risks, both known and unknown. The possibility of tiny black holes or other exotic phenomena that could have unexpected effects is one of the most pressing concerns regarding the operation of the Large Hadron Collider. The possibility of accidentally unleashing forces beyond our control is still unsettling, despite the fact that theoretical calculations suggest that any such black holes would be ephemeral and do not pose any threat to Earth or the people who live there. In addition, in order to reduce any potential risks, the Collider experiment's sheer scale and complexity necessitate stringent supervision and meticulous safety procedures. The Collider's global community of scientists and researchers is acutely aware of the need to place safety first and ensure that all experiments are carried out with the utmost responsibility and care. With its unprecedented capacity to delve into the fabric of reality, the Large Hadron Collider, LHC, is not only a marvel of contemporary engineering, but also a focal point of contemporary physics and cosmology. The fundamental particles that make up the universe, which is its primary goal, have profound implications for how we understand existence. The Higgs boson and other fundamental particles can be studied in a unique way thanks to the LHC, 
which gives researchers the chance to recreate the conditions of the early universe just moments after the Big Bang. Peter Higgs and others hypothesized the Higgs boson, also known as the God particle, in 1964 as a crucial component of the standard model of particle physics. The fundamental forces and particles that make up the universe are outlined in this model. In 2012, the Higgs boson was discovered at the LHC, confirming the existence of the Higgs field, an invisible field that gives other particles mass. It was a monumental achievement to make this discovery, which confirmed decades of theoretical work and improved our comprehension of the fundamental structure of the universe. However, the pursuit of knowledge at the LHC has its share of potential dangers and ethical quandaries, just like any great scientific endeavor. Particle collisions at the LHC require enormous energies, so it is impossible to completely rule out the possibility of creating novel forms of matter or triggering unexpected reactions. High-energy collisions may result in microscopic black holes or other exotic entities, according to some theorists, posing questions regarding their potential outcomes. Despite the fact that the majority of scientists believe these risks to be extremely remote, the very nature of scientific investigation necessitates taking risks in the unknown.